I am here with Pudge Rodriguez, a catcher of the Washington Nationals. And Pudge, I know your true competition is the National League East, but is there any extra buzz here with the Orioles in town? Uh, well, you know, we you know, it's pretty much another series, to be honest with you. You know, I know that, we, that we're going to play against America League, in the league, and it's something different. But, but our plan is just to go out there and do the same thing that we've been doing every day, just to go out there and play hard make the plays and, and try to do the things that we've been doing all year round. But do you like interleague play? Sometimes is it, is it good for a team to see some, some new fresh faces? Yeah, it's, it's, it's good. It's, it's, it's better for the fans. It's good for the fans to come and see something different. And, and for us, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty much another series. Uh, but the fans, you know, it's, it's always nice to come and, and, and see the Orioles, you know, a team that they, they only come here for three days, three games. Uh, and, you know, when they come to Kansas City, Detroit, all those guys, it's, it's, it's different. Uh, but, you know, as far as, you know, the schedule is kind of complicated because, you know, sometimes we play two games in one city and, and you have to go there and, and pack and, and, and unpack and pack quick and go. But that's, that's you know, that's part of baseball. We have to we have to do what they tell us to do. But, but for all it's just, you know, we got to prepare ourselves for another series and, and just to go out there and do our best. Okay, well, speaking of preparation, especially for a catcher, is there more preparation that goes into a series like this? Because you, you've probably never faced some of these some of these pitchers. Well, you know, what we do, uh, what we're going to do with the, with Baltimore today, we always do in every series. We we have a meeting uh, with a pitching coach, and and he tells us what you know what we need to do. Uh, they, they, we're going through every hitter and what they you know what they hit, what they don't hit, things like that, and. And basically, that's what we're going to do today. I think our meeting is going to be in the next 20 minutes. We're going to go and sit down and talk about the study lineup and the extra guys, and we go from there. All right, you have Olsen, Stammen, and Lannon going this weekend. Talk to me about Scott Olsen. He won the number five spot out of spring training. How impressive has he been? Well, he's been very good. I think uh, the best thing that he's been doing is just attack the strike zone right away. He, he just started, you know, throwing strike one, and he's glad he's been doing very good. You know, he's, you know, late break. Uh, break into the uh, uh, back foot of right-handed hitters and, and away from lefties. He's, he's been doing great. I mean, the, the, the good thing is that he's just challenges try on, get ahead in the count, and, and don't use too many pitches. So hopefully he, he comes back the same way tonight and, and get a W for us. Pudge, last question, non-baseball related. I want to ask you about the team chemistry on this team. There's so much talk about this division and the fact that it's not just about the Mets and the Phillies anymore. Is this a fun team to play on, and how much has chemistry helped you guys in the win column? Well, it's been very positive. You know, I think the uh, uh, we have a, a, a very nice group of guys in the clubhouse that we all uh, take care of each other. You know, we joke around, everybody's happy, and that's the attitude that you have to to get. You know, starting in the clubhouse, and that's the attitude that you take into the field. And basically, that's what we do. We have fun playing, we have fun in the clubhouse, and when those things happen, you know, you're gonna end up winning a lot of ball games, and and that's what we're doing. And Levo and Niger are right in the middle of all that, right? Yeah, I mean, those guys are, are very nice, you know, especially Nigel. He's a nice guy. He likes to joke around. You know, he's a funny guy. Smile all the time. And, and, and it's always nice to have guys like that in the clubhouse. Thanks, Pudge. I appreciate it.